It's a plan to remedy Madison's financially troubled golf courses. But now some city officials and residents are teeing off as one of the solutions involves selling the beloved Monona golf course. Our Keely Arthur has a closer look at the potential plan. It's new tonight at 10. Most mornings in the summer we come. Step one foot on the Monona golf course and you'll feel the love for this place. Madison courses are great, all of them, but this, this nine I like the best of any of them. It's a fun course to play. Bring up the fact that Madison officials are looking into closing it and you'll get even more passionate responses. Yeah, we were very very concerned that they might do that. I think they should leave it alone. The Monona golf course could soon be no more. The city is looking into maybe getting rid of this land to focus on the other three courses instead. If you do a full cost accounting, uh, we've operated eight of the last nine years at a loss. To fix Madison Golf's financial woes, the city is looking into three options. Put tax dollars toward what is supposed to be a self-sustaining golf enterprise fund, sell Yahara Hills Golf Course, or transform some of the land at Monona into a park and sell the rest. It's very connected to the rest of the city. That is desirable in the eyes of real estate developers. At a public meeting Tuesday night, several residents voiced frustrations over the Monona option. You're waging war on my golf course. But with city tax dollars likely going to more pressing matters and the sale of the 36 holes at Yahara reducing the city's holes by half, selling Monona is beginning to look like the most viable option. That type of a move would be we see future growth opportunity for golf Madison parks and could do some interesting new things. In Madison, Keely Arthur, WISC News 3. An official decision could come next April after the Parks Department gives its recommendation and Madison City Council votes on it.